I got all this stuff out here. I kind of reorganized my bag from some of the stuff that was in the drawer, so I'm all packed up there. Tomorrow morning, I'll probably do the rest of my electronics and all that stuff. But yeah, we got the cereal. We're doing pretty good. I'm gonna make sure I don't forget nothing though, because that would be like the worst. <laughs> Yo, what's going on guys? It's your broski, you little night guy, coming at you with a brand new video, and today, we just made it back home, to the home, to the stomping grounds of me. You guys know I used to sit right here, record all my videos, that's awesome, but make sure you guys are following my Insta and Snap right here, and follow my, all my other social medias, they are all down below. Thank you for all the support you show me, you guys mean a lot, and I'm about to go open some cards and some gifts that were here since it was my birthday like two days ago, it is December 14th now. It's like 1 something in the morning, almost 2 a.m. You guys know, I just got home because it took us about an hour and a half to empty out my room because I suck at taking care of cleaning out my room because you already know. With me, sometimes I procrastinate with that stuff, but we ended up getting everything out okay. I turned in my room key to my RA and stuff like that, and we actually stopped by Walmart and a couple other places, but we didn't do much because we just got a couple of stuff to survive you know what i mean some basic life needs yo what's good <laughs> what's up yo. you miss me nah you don't miss me you hate me <laughs> no. you hate me we got the whole collection some gifts a lot of cards you guys know i love cards i got like the best relatives i swear like i love my relatives and all my family so much but literally 1.37 a.m. We are still going strong. Donuts. Yo, shout out to my uncle for hooking me up with the <laughs> things that are 95% chance of losing. We already know we do it because we are for lenses. We're from New Jersey. That's kind of like a Jersey thing. You got to do the lottery all the time. Some of you are from New Jersey. Like, I want to know, have you guys ever won one of these things ever before? So, thanks to my uncle. Like, I, maybe I'll win, like, $2 on this or something. You never know. Also, shout out to my nanny for getting me another lottery ticket. Maybe I'll even have a better chance. Maybe I'll get 5 bucks this time. You never know. 5 bucks is, like, basically, if you get 5 bucks and you win the lottery, like, you're literally just as much as a chance of becoming a millionaire is earning 5 bucks. But thanks, nanny. That means a lot. Yo, I'm also going to have to get this set up tomorrow. We got my Christmas tree here. We got some of the ornaments and the light bulbs are right there. And also, I'm probably going to do my light bulb setup again, where I start here, plug them in, and have them kind of run across halfway in my room. And that's what I did last year. And it was, like, really cool because it really gave my room, like, the Christmas holiday vibe. And you already know, you got to you gotta go all out on the holidays. No matter what you celebrate, you got to go all out on the holiday you celebrate. But it is so late, though. I'm probably going to probably calm down for the night. Honestly, it's been a long day, but it's been a good day because... I got to reunite with my mom, and I'm going to see my dad when he wakes up in the morning. We're going to kind of, you know, just spend some father-son time. Yo. Guys, check it out. We actually got some Christmas lights down here because that's my dad's current project. He was testing them out, and some of them obviously work, but some of them obviously don't work. Because that happens like every year, half of our Christmas lights go dead, and we gotta buy new ones. But I think we got enough this year that is good enough to be able to support our house and all that. And honestly, yeah, I just woke up about an hour ago, had some coffee, had a uh, muffin, a donut from... I don't know where the donut was from, it was probably Walmart, but it's pretty good. Not as good as Krispy Kreme though. Krispy Kreme, they got the best donuts. But I'm obviously about to go for a run to continue my daily morning exercise that I always try to get in. So I'm going to do that before it starts raining because the forecast says that it's going to start raining later and I need to get my run in before that happens. So yeah, let's just keep the day going. My mom and I might bake something later because she's got a whole bunch of supplies that she bought yesterday from Walmart and I just kind of hung out in the car because it was raining and I don't know, I was tired as, yeah, I was very tired. Yeah, check all this out. We got the Reese's things, the almond barks. These are awesome vanilla almond barks. Um, Gerardo Lee chocolate chips. Gerardo Lee is so good. So, I think sh brown sugar, dark brown sugar, powdered sugar, Toll House chocolate. Oof. Guys, this can only mean one thing. 
We might be baking depressed cookies. We might be baking chocolate chip cookies. I mean, I don't know. There's a lot of different recipes that you can make with that stuff. Yo, what? What do you want, bro? What's good? What are you saying? Yo. Just, yo. Guys, I don't know if Sonny... I don't know if Sonny likes me anymore. Yo, come here. Yeah, we got all the decorations up here. We got these. I've had this decoration since I was a little kid. That was like my favorite one. I used to just look at it all the time for no reason. Got countdown. It's actually like 11 days till Christmas. All these. Abominable snowman <laughs> from Rudolph. What? Yo, what are you doing? Hey, look at all our stockings. Mine's like the biggest. <laughs> I got a different one. Look up. Dude, it's, it's so big. What? Man himself. Italy. Check it. Gang. Even though it was raining, that was a great run, but I'm about to go help my dad out with some of the Christmas lights. And I don't know, just check out how he's doing, probably have some more coffee. But honestly, I feel great. Exercise is great. Make sure you guys go exercise at least one time a day, even if it's like 30 minutes or an hour. Like, anything can work out. Alright, so we got some progress made with the Christmas lights. I was just helping my dad clean up some sticks. Check it out, we got the front ones. Oh yeah. And the ones on the that gutter. And honestly, I'm trying to still get the one set up in my room because we're going to turn my room into North Pole. Right. You already know. It's, it's the season. But we still got a pumpkin here. Why we still got this? Bro, it's, it's not Halloween. It ain't Halloween. Yeah, we're going to be getting a tree. Probably the easy way, though, because we're tired of dealing with pin needles all over and... Right. Honestly, we're still trying to wait because the new kitten hasn't seen a Christmas tree yet And we're thinking that she might want to tear the crap out of it and destroy it So that's something you guys should look forward to We're <laughs> yeah, gonna try to right. catch We are gonna try to catch Penelope in the Christmas tree in the act Right, and Screw then we will get rid of her <laughs> No <laughs> nah. Yeah, mom will be pissed though Alright Yeah, she's Penelope friendly now. She lets me pat her Oh, she's not gonna let me. I, I'll, I'll see her on like J January fifth. You, you gotta go easy because you know she's a little spooked. Yeah. But she's starting to warm up. Uh huh. Because she was like that with me. She didn't want to have anything to do. With she didn't. She was. She's just mad shy though. That's the thing. Yo, I can't wait for Buckeyes though and Bull of Bread. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We're gonna make all the healthy vintage. Yeah. Well, healthy to us because yes. because we invented all of it. It's what the season's about. The season, it's about eating a bunch of cookies and not giving and a crap. And worry about your diet after New Year's. Yeah, and yeah, guys, I'm definitely going to be eating healthier than I ever have next year. I'm going to be cutting out a lot of bad types of food. Because I've been trying to eat healthy since I got to college since. You're doing good, Nick. I don't know, you, you, can, always, great. you can always eat a little healthier, you know what I mean? So, that'll be good. I swear, guys, I have an addiction to ramen noodles. It's so good. I feel like even if I was rich, I'd still eat ramen, like, all the time. Like, you just can't beat it. Especially the chili flavor. If you guys want to send me something as a gift, get me chili ramen and just send it to, like, I mean, I could give you guys, like, a P.O. box and just send me all the ramen that you can. So our first recipe that we're gonna kind of just, I'm gonna show you guys bits and pieces of what we're doing here. This is like chocolate chips on top of like the vanilla pieces right there. That's awesome. That's vanilla bark. Vanilla bark, all right. See, we got all the stuff out here, 
our chocolate chips, all the recipes, that's kind of just like some sauce that we're making too. So I'm in charge of the butter and what's that on top? Brown the sugar. sugar. The brown sugar. My mom's sorting up the graham crackers into perfect order. Look at that. It's, can't mess that up at all. We also got the chocolate chips and the vanilla sticks in there melting up. Get us the blazes out of here. That's looking good. This is uh, going on top. Awesome. Have we made this before? Yes, last year. Oh, uh, I think Graham I remember. Graham cracker candy. I think I remember. It was pretty good. We made a whole bunch of crazy recipes. Didn't we also make that chocolate clumpy things? What were they? Like, that's what that is, right? Yeah. Oh, man. Those are so good. I can't wait to have them. Ooh. Sprinkling on the top. Best part. Best part about it all. So what kind of a taste does it give it? When you like have the stuff on Butterscotchy. It? Butter, this is, butterscotch. This is butterscotch, okay. Taste. Awesome. I believe it. Now if you can. It literally can smells. Alright, yeah, it literally has that rich butterscotch like smell to it. Mm -hmm. Like this? Yeah, spread it out. Alright. This is my job. Okay, you want to do it? Wait, you want to keep it on the. Yeah. So, kind of like this a little bit. Hot. You want to get down low if you okay. can and just go across. So, kind of just like this? Yeah, you want, you're trying to get it all over. All over. Oh, okay. I'm getting some assistance from my chef mother who gives tips. <laughs> I think you've watched this movie a few times. Huh? Because I didn't realize that was in the words. You know, you know the words a lot of this movie. Whole thing. Yeah. All right, guys, check it out. It's just oh. oh, you can turn that off. <laughs> Interrupted me. It's all good. So this is what it looks like after you take it out. That is the butterscotch graham crackers, the one and only, one of my mom's 20,000 recipes. So if you guys need, you'll have to pay my mom about $1,000 to bake you some cookies for Christmas. <laughs> we got- This is like candy, almost. It literally is. It's really good though. It's good candy, homemade. And now you put the chocolate on there. Now this is where, that's where my mom's a genius because once there's already the butterscotch layered on top of the graham crackers and then you add this chocolate, gives it that mixture of what it tastes like. Open this up. All right. Before it gets this soft. This good. So now we gotta show you guys the reveal of, what's the name of it? This, these are peanut clusters, but they're not ready yet. Yeah, peanut clusters. We're just melting. Ooh. That looks powerful. Wow, look at that. It's like a giant marshmallow filled with like chocolate syrup. It's almost done. What do you guys think of that? Hit me up and if you want any of these recipes, cause you get them off the internet, right? They're not. Yeah. They're the not, crock pot peanut clusters. They're not clusters. secret, right? Because if they're secret, no. then that's just no us. No secret. We do have some recipes, guys, that are secret. And we'll still show you bits and pieces of bacon, but we won't be telling you all the details. Now we're actually going to make the, what do you call these cookies? Your favorite cookie. My favorite ones. The chocolate dip. Yep. 
gonna be good. This is like how you start off, you know, where you mix the butter up. It's probably the most challenging because you make one mistake in it. No, it's okay. It'll uh, end up in the living room. Well, I'm actually going to end the video up there. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoy, please make sure to smash that like button and also hit that subscribe button to join this awesome family. You guys are all awesome. Thank you for all the support you've been showing me on my YouTube channel and all my social medias. It means so much. I can't say that enough, but honestly, it's been a good day. I'm glad to be back here with my family and bake some cookies and bake some other like Christmas desserts and all that type of stuff, but more to come. Tomorrow, we might get a Christmas tree or something like that. I'm not 100% sure. Let's just hope it doesn't rain and the weather is at least nice or maybe some snow. That would be really cool. But honestly, it's been a good day. I'm going to end it off here. Vlogmas 2K19 and we are out. Peace.